can't see anything clearly. The video seems to be captured by my grandmother's camera. Quality is always unstable. Unfollow. Does your live streaming look blurry? Don't worry. In today's video, I will show you how to take your live streaming from looking like this to this. The Venus Live V2 has three live streaming options. The UVC streaming, the app streaming, and the RTMP streaming. Each has its own setup and quality settings. Let's break them down. Venus Live V2 can achieve UVC streaming by using a UVC cable to transmit videos, including audio and video, to the computer, then adding a streaming URL and key. You can use either a laptop or desktop for this. But if you are looking for stability doing long professional live streaming, a desktop is your best bet due to better cooling and performance. Here's the recommended PC setup for smooth streaming. Once connected to your computer, the first step is to launch OBS and click the Sources, Video Capture Device to add a new source. Choose Hollyland device as your device from the drop-down menu, and here comes your video. Set the resolution and FPS type as Custom. Set your stream's resolution to 1080p and the frame rate to 30fps. Choose video format as YUY2. Color space as Rec.709. Color range as Limited. And tick Use Custom Audio Device, then click OK. One key setting is the bit rate. If it's too high, your viewers might experience lag. Too low, and the video will look blurry. For optimal settings in OBS, Click Settings, choose Output, set your video bitrate within the range of 6000 kbps to 8000 kbps. Fine tuning based on your network speed for the best quality. Choose Hardware Encoding as your video encoder, and Balanced as the encoder preset. Under the Video tab, configure both your base and output resolutions to 1920 by 1080 pixels, and maintain the common FPS values at 30 FPS. And finally, don't forget to hit save. Once your camera is connected to the internet, just hit the RTMP icon, enter the stream key, and you're all set. The Venus Live V2 has built-in apps for popular platforms like TikTok and Instagram. For example, on Instagram, just connect to Wi-Fi, log in, and you are ready to go live instantly. While platforms themselves often limit the quality output, the Venus Live V2 allows you to tweak your stream settings before going live. For a hassle-free experience, you can go with the Auto Mode, which automatically adjusts colors and parameters. But if you prefer manual control, Click on the floating window to open Pro Mode, where you will find all the advanced color settings. First, white balance. If you want a cooler tone, lower the value. For a warmer look, increase it. A typical setting for natural lighting is 5600K, but if you are unsure, just click Auto, and it will adjust automatically. The camera has HDR enabled by default. If you find that ISO and shutter settings are locked, you will need to turn off HDR first. However, we recommend it leaving HDR on, and it lets you adjust EV instead. EV controls the brightness. Higher EV means a brighter image, and the lower EV makes it darker. If you notice flickering in the video, you can enable anti-flicker and choose either 50Hz or 60Hz to reduce it. Other basic parameters can be fine-tuned depending on the look you are going for. Beyond image quality, the Venus Life V2 also includes a built-in beauty filter, with more enhancements coming in future updates, so you will always look your best on stream. With these settings, you will see a significant improvement in your live stream quality. Let's take a look at a comparison of different streaming methods. UVC streaming delivers the best results with UltraShop 4K30 video. RTMP streaming comes in next, and app streaming is a bit more limited by the platform restrictions. But with the Venus Live V2, you can still tweak your settings for a clearer, sharper stream. Besides video quality, sound is another big deal in live streaming. 
The Venus Live V2 offers three audio input options, built-in mic, 3.5mm input, and Type-C mic input. For best results, I recommend pairing it with the Hollyland Lark M2 wireless mic for crystal clear sound, complementing your high-quality video. Of course, lighting plays a very huge role in the live stream quality as well. So if you want to learn more about the lighting setups, check our previous videos. Okay, the above is our camera settings for the live streaming. Did these tips help you out? There is a lot more to cover when it comes to live streaming. Let me know in the comments what you'd like to see next. Bye-bye.